There is no such procedure in the current law for uh, somebody getting a gender recognition certificate. Uh, my comments about her, uh, the, the person being a rapist is in context of what should happen to them within the prison service. This is a Thank you, uh, First Minister. Um, I think you just referred to Ireland Bryson using the word her. Does that mean you do, in fact, think Don't she is a woman? anything into... I, I am trying to rationally... To individual, Look, you started I, saying I'm, her. What I'm trying to do is address the issues rather than take it into the kind of... Uh, you know, headline generating. I, I'm trying to rationally deal with the issues that arise here, um, and that's what I'll continue to but, try to do. Why did you say that? I, you, I, I can't remember. I'll it take your word for it. it. Well, like fine. A Freudian Look, slip I'm, I'm trying not Isla to. Bryson as a woman, is that I'm, not the case? But, but what I'm saying is, Isla Bryson calls herself a woman. But what I'm trying to say is, in the context of the prison service, that is not the relevant factor here. The relevant factor is the crime that uh, the individual was committed, uh, has committed, and has been convicted of. But we've all been asking you, and you've been running away from the, uh, the question. We have been asking you for days. Do you regard Isla Bryson as she a woman? She regards herself as a woman. I regard uh, the individual as a rapist. And in the context, to say whether the, the context of the prison service, what matters man. is that uh, the individual was convicted of rape. And that is what we're talking about here. And that's what I will continue to, to focus on.